day of rage. Thousands of Muslim Brotherhood supporters came out to show their anger at the ousting of Muhammad Morsi and the swift installation of an unelected interim leader. Leader of the Muslim Brotherhood, Muhammad Badi, urged supporters to continue protesting until Morsi is returned to power. The army is now involved in politics once more, and we say to them, it's time for you to return to your people and protect the borders. This is your role. As for our role, we will, God willing, be open to anything once our elected president, Muhammad Morsi, is retained. By Friday evening, the tension began to rise. Military vehicles raced onto one of Cairo's main bridges over the Nile to break up clashes between Morsi supporters and those celebrating his removal. Armored vehicles were also deployed on the 6th of October bridge near Tahrir Square in an attempt to disperse the crowds. Egypt's first freely elected president was toppled on Wednesday in what his supporters say was a military coup. It's the latest twist in the tumultuous two years since the fall of Hosni Mubarak in 2011. On Thursday, senior judge Adli Mansour was appointed as Egypt's interim president. In his first constitutional declaration on Friday, Mansour dissolved the Shura Council, which was dominated by Morsi's allies. Mansour also appointed a new head of intelligence and advisor for security affairs. Zhang Yaqing, CCTV.